Earlier you created a G55 work offset for your T-nut in this end of the vise. Now we actually want to add a toolpath. If I push F9, it shows me currently I have one work offset active. It's my G54 and my toolpath tell me that I'm working from the top construction plane. Because I'm going to post the code out to a Funoke machine, the first work offset is always the top and it will post out G54. Now I want to switch and tell it I want to work on this G55 part. Recall the exact distance between the parts doesn't really matter because on the machine I'm going to set up a new work offset G55 and the zero will be for this part on this corner. To activate that work offset, which is critical I do before I add any tool pass to this part, I'm going to come down here to the status bar and I'm going to click on WCS and then I'm going to select Plane Manager. My plane manager window will open up. I'm going to select my G55 plane. I'll get a preview here showing me what it is. And I'm going to tell the system to make it equal. So what I've told is the construction and tool plane is now working from the G55 part. So when I post the code for any tool paths created here, the G55 will be there. And when I post the code for any tool paths created on this part, we'll see the G54. So I'm going to accept this and now I can add my toolpaths to this part. 